new game. Oh my god, that was cr Wow. What's my goal? Escape squid. Unicorn says, escaping him? Are you kidding? You'll have to destroy him. Nice. Really looking forward to getting my revenge. There's a bit more going on here, though. I'm curious, where does that button go to? I don't know! 157 is a nice number. What were you doing there, human? What were the? you reading something? Interesting. I don't see anything over there. Very suspicious. Uh huh. The goal of this game is for you to die. Just jump directly into the spikes, please. Uh, ah, fuck! What are you on about? Every single light represents a conscious being in one of my simulations. Come on, 
Ah, uh, fuck. Spikes are just there for decoration. The inhabitants of a simulation can be more than alive. They experience love, happiness, fear. But even more importantly, they can also experience pain. And the best part is, I have full control over this simulation, so I can hurt my virtual prisoners as much as I please. Look closely, human. The beings represented by these lights are suffering from unimaginable pain right now. They might be simulated, but their pain is real. And so is my joy. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you want to stop these poor souls from suffering. Spoiler, you can't. <laughs> they are forever mine. And now it is time for you to suffer. The rules are simple. You just try to reach the end of the level, and I'll try to kill you. Good luck. My prediction algorithm can predict every move you'll make. Maybe try to be a bit less predictable next time. I adjusted your difficulty level a bit, because I really dislike seeing you proceed at such a rapid pace. You're playing on very easy now. Enjoy. That was not quite the correct timing for that jump, I guess, eh? As you can see, there are two different paths, which lead to two different rooms. The bottom path is where the main game continues, so I suggest you take that one for now. Congrats, that was your 10th death in this level. And where you want it to, huh?
First try. is auto. Death per second, by the 
way. Lol, your death frequency is higher than the neural activity in your brain. Blindly moving in one direction no matter what. Brain strategy. That incredible willingness to blindly run into your inevitable doom keeps impressing me. Did you really not see that coming? Really? more than holding one button. For beginners. For complete beginners who are bad at platforming. For complete beginners who are bad at platforming and a bit dumb. For complete beginners who are bad at platforming and a bit dumb and have slow reflexes. Wait a second. Did you just voluntarily select the easiest difficulty? Not sure if I should shame you for that or if I should applaud you for your self-awareness. Okay, I've made up my mind. Shame. <laughs> shame. And here come the conveyor belts. Guess who is in control of the conveyor belts? It's me. First try. Are you serious? That's it right. Easier. Even more conveyor belts. I know you secretly love them as much as I do. What the fuck? And that's how the suffering begins. What? Oh god. Wait.
fallen down when you destroyed them. At least your performance is not the only thing rapidly dropping downwards for no reason. Swedish robot. Oh no. The genres are platforming and cyberbullying. <laughs> you know, two of my favorite genres. Congrats. That was a fifth of the game. Killer robots, how did it all start? Okay, let me out. I did it. I beat a fifth of the game. I was like 30 minutes. No more cyberbullying. Holy fuck. Surprise, I mean, at least I w infinitely easy is my speed. <laughs>